Hey everyone, this is Paul Nishihara, Applications Engineer with Go Engineer, and welcome to another session of SolidWorks Drawing Tips, three minutes or less. In this session, we're going to talk about an alternative way for setting table anchors. Traditionally, to set a table anchor, most people would right-click in the display area, edit sheet format, and then locate a corner point or a vertex to establish an anchor point. So as an example, if I were to set an anchor point here, I would right-click, choose whichever table that I would like to anchor to that point. An alternative way of setting a table anchor is to access the items in the Feature Manager tree. So we'll expand Open Sheet 1, and under the Sheet Format, we have all of the different tables available to us. Let's do two examples. The first example, we'll right-click on Bill of Materials, left-click on Set Anchor, and at this point, you're going to notice that you're inside of the Edit Sheet Format. Now it's just a matter of selecting the corner geometry where you want to set the anchor. And then we can move on to the next item. We'll do Revision Table Anchor. Again, right-click, left-click on Set Anchor, and we'll locate this Revision Table Anchor in, on the opposite side. Now, when we insert our tables, it will go ahead and specify in the correct orientation. So I'll go to Tables, Bill of Materials, we'll reference this drawing, attach it to an anchor point, green check mark, and there's one item. Let's go ahead and resize it a little bit. The next item is our revision table. Again, tables, revision table, green check mark, and we'll go ahead and resize it as well. Easy as that. I hope this video was helpful to you in showing you an alternative way of setting table anchors. This is Paul with Go Engineer. Thanks for watching.